Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for uh, once again um, being a supporter of my channel. Uh, for those who are new to my channel, make sure to subscribe here at the bottom. Uh, don't forget to hit the uh, bell to keep up with the latest uh, topics for my uh, channel. Make sure to write down a comment at the bottom if you are um, want to start a new uh, dialogue discussion of particular topics that I talk about. Also make sure to hit the like button. Okay, so today we're going to be talking about uh, vitamins and doctors and how they believe that uh, taking vitamins are not a help to your health, which I totally disagree. I believe that, uh, my belief is that uh, it is good to take vitamins in because as you eat your daily diet, your food for your daily diet each week, some of the uh, food that you eat, you may be missing out on certain uh, vitamins. Uh, so uh, vitamins, multivitamins, uh, fish oil are a good source of those vitamins that you do not receive or uh, get throughout the week. So, uh, I take these here. I remember when uh, multivitamins used to come in those tablets, those horse pills, they used to call them, they were very large, and they were hard to swallow. Well, come to find out they were saying that those are the ones that uh, cause cancer. So, I uh, pretty much switched from them because it was very difficult to swallow. And, you know, many doctors said that they uh, gave cancer. If that's true or not, I don't know, but I stopped because, not because of the whole cancer scare, but due to uh, not being able to swallow them. So I went to uh, gummies and uh, not going back. So I usually take two of these a day along with uh, fish oil. And I take one of these and what I do is instead of swallowing the pill is I put it in my uh, drinks that I uh, take in the morning, maybe orange juice, apple juice, whatever. I uh, puncture the uh, pill, pour it in my uh, drink, and that's how I normally uh, take the fish oil. Now, there was a study put out by uh, numerous doctors that vitamins do not uh, work towards keeping individuals healthy which I totally disagree and I'm gonna tell you why and the reason behind that I think is that many people are probably taking um, vitamins nowadays and maybe uh, doctors realize that a lot more people are, be, are coming aware of vitamins are taking them and they're probably being come in to uh, the hospital more healthier and they're realizing that if individuals are more healthier, that means less people they can uh, prescribe medicine to, right, or take care of. You know, they're quick to say that multivitamins and vitamins are bad for you, but they're not saying that the medicines, the pills that they give you, they're not mentioning anything about that, okay? Last time I checked, uh, the pills they gave you, they have all these side effects. They may cure one thing, but give you something else. And the take and replace of that uh, ailment so it's just funny how doctors are saying vitamins are bad for you but yet the uh, medicine they prescribe to the patient they're not talking about that not being uh, healthy for you and the side effects that come from all those uh, pills that they give you I mean you come in to the uh, doctors uh, getting prescribed the medicine and taking it and you know, you, you, you're leaving and you're taking these pills and you're becoming even worse than you was when you first came. So, no, I don't believe that uh, taking vitamins is bad for you. Actually, I believe that uh, vitamins are actually good for you. Okay, they keep you more alert, keep your uh, blood pressure much lower, uh, put more vitamins, uh, help out with your skin and bones. So. I'm not a doctor, but uh, 
last time I went to the hospital, uh, they checked my uh, vital signs and my blood pressure and my uh, blood, and they said that I, I'm like was the highest when it came to um, cholesterol and everything else. My cholesterol was down, um, blood pressure was down. They was shocked and surprised that you know I'm like one of the few people that came into that uh, doctor office that was so much in health. They were shocked. You know, and all I do is just take these two each day. I take my multivitamins, I take two a day, and I just take my fish oil. Okay, put it in my drink, drink it, and I'm good to go for the rest of the day. You know, so doctors can tell you, are quick to tell you about how vitamins are not good for you. But they're not quick to tell you how the medicine they give you, which will give you uh, side effects and make it even worse, okay? Because they know this is a business. Hospitals know, doctors know this is a business. If more people are healthy, that means less uh, patients, and that means less people to deal with and try to uh, prescribe medicine to, okay? So it's all a game. They're all about making the money. We all know that by now, okay? It, it's, it's not rocket science. So, in order to stay healthy, in order to stay out of the doctor's office, and just do your routine uh, checkups, because that's all basically what you need to do each year, is do your routine checkup, because in actuality, if you do a routine checkup each year, that actually saves you money, because that helps the doctors to find out if any ailments where you can uh, take care of those things as quick as possible instead of waiting and prolonging where it builds up and then makes you know you have to go to the emergency room because you never took care of the problems that you were uh, accruing during your life because you never did checkups. So make sure to do your regular checkup each year. Also take your vitamins. Also make sure to eat your breakfast. That's one of the most important meals of the day and I'm going to tell you why. Many people don't talk about it. If you just get breakfast, okay, you have to understand when you skip breakfast, that cause your body to build and eat off this, what you stored. Because breakfast allows your metabolism to speed up. And that helps you to burn more energy if that keeps you thin and trim. If you skip breakfast, then you go to lunch, that's like, lunch is like one of the meals that is more hearty, you eat more, and that causes you to slow your metabolism down, causes you to gain more weight. So make sure, eat breakfast, make sure, exercise. Maybe I'll probably take you guys on one of my uh, walks to see how far I walk. Because like I said, you don't have to go to the gym and pump all this iron and stay in shape. You can be just as good a shape as those individuals at the gym. So maybe I should do that, take you on one of my walks with me and let you uh, see exactly what I do, my regimen. But yeah, all you gotta do, eat breakfast, take a walk, run, take a bike ride, stay active, take your vitamins, You're probably even more shaped than these doctors who prescribe all this medicine. A lot of them, their, their life is all messed up and they're trying to tell you how to live your life. Okay? So, once again, subscribe to my channel if you're new. If you're not, continue watching. Make sure to give me a like. Also, hit the uh, bell. And if you agree or disagree, that's fine. Just make sure to write down a comment at the bottom. Until next time, enjoy your day. And... Peace out.